has gone mad. It is running all over the fields and is destroying the crops. It is attacking the farmers too. How do we stop it? Let's go. We must stop this and complain to Kalia. Yeah, yeah. Yes, let's, yes, go. Let's, let's go. go. Let's, let's go. go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Raju's life is in danger. I must do something and help him. Uncle, help me! That beam is younger to me and not at all as powerful as I am. But I don't know why I always lose to him. Exactly, my boy. Why fear when I'm here? They don't call me danger for nothing. But uncle, how do I beat him? Will you help me? Relax, my boy. Relax. Exactly. That is why I brought this book for you, which has got lot of tricks in this. You know. Take it. Uncle, just teach me all the tricks in this book. That's it. Okay, let us start teaching you. Jadugar Kambata. Friends, Romans, Indians, rich, poor, sane, and madmen, may I have your attention, please? This coin is going to rotate itself on the edge of the handkerchief. So here it goes, and there it goes. This coin on its own moves to and fro. So this is about it, ladies and gentlemen. Did you see? How did you like it, huh? <laughs> okay, for my this show, I would like to have one of y'all as my assistant. Ha, huh, you, you there, why don't you step up? Huh? Come, come, don't be scared, nothing's going to happen to you. Come. So what do you see here in my hand? It's a gold coin. Very smart. Now here I keep it in my palm and what you shall do is close my palm. Ah. 
<laughs> so the coin is here in the palm of my hand and I shall make the coin disappear. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, here we go. Abracadabra, hocus pocus. All of you all pay attention. Abracadabra, hocus pocus and the coin has gone. <laughs> All right, all right, adults aside, now I need the kids besides. Who wants to come? Any kid, any kid, come up. Oh, wow, you there, my brave child. I hope you're not scared, my child. No, I'm not scared. Very well, then. What do you see inside this hat? Uh, nothing. A-E-I-O-U and boo. Out of the hat comes a rat. So that's all for the evening, folks. I'll be back next time with some bigger and better magic. But for now, I will have to go. A-E-I-O-U and boom! Hey, Bheem! Bheem! Look here! The Jadugar forgot his magic stick here! Oh, wow! Now I will practice magic on you all! Brim, bra, bra, boo! Brim, bra, boo, boo! Gin and fruits! Turn them into fruits! Huh? Oh my god, what do I do now? Change the trend! Please bring back my friends! <laughs> It's not working. What do I do? Somebody help me. Where's the Jadugar? Somebody help me, please. Jadugar, please help. Jadugar, where are you? Hey, kiddo. Did you miss me? Jadugar, uncle. Jadugar, uncle. Save my friend. Okay, hand me my magic wand. Hmm, monkey, donkey, cat and dog. Here's this one for you all. Hmm, boo! Okay, kiddo, I'll have to go now. Boo! Welcome to the kingdom of Dholatpur. We are just messengers of our king Ego Hito. From this year on, you are bound to give us one lakh golden coins annually. And if not, then get ready for war. Calm down. If one does not meet this annual demand, then the forces will readily attack. But Dholatpur is a very small kingdom. If your king is trying to threaten us with his huge army, then he is not brave. Quiet. Our king Ego Hito has proclaimed that if any citizen of any of the kingdoms who manages to win over Sam in a fight, that kingdom will be free from bondage. So if you don't want to pay up the tax demanded, then get prepared to triumph over Sam. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> so these are your brave warriors. <laughs> your Majesty, I challenge Sam for a fight. Go ahead and fight. You will definitely win. <laughs> Oh no, 
He has lost his sword too. After a few seconds, even Kalia will surrender. Yeah! <laughs> the fate of the kingdom is in your hands, Nabhim. Go and fight with all your might. Your Majesty, please don't worry. The kingdom of Dolapur knows only one king, and that's you, Your Majesty. Be 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 you can do it! surrender to you. Don't be sad, Sam. You too are very brave. It is it is job. <laughs> Do you also want to know about your future? I've heard a lot about this parrot called Paru from a lot of people. Is it all true? You can hear about your future from this unique parrot right now. And his prediction is always right. Hmm, I see. But I have a strange feeling I've seen you somewhere. Huh? Well, maybe I'm mistaken. But then no one can forget you and your unique parrot easily. Oh. But why are you here? Your Majesty, sometimes people want to know only about the good huh? things about Paru. But Paro is only a parrot. She simply cannot tell what is good and what is bad. Hmm. And what are you planning to do for the future? Well, we shall leave this place tomorrow. Hmm. No, Babu. You continue to stay here. Thank you, Your Majesty. Now please instruct Paro to read my future. Babu was speaking to them very rudely. He was not at all like the person we all know. But if it's a game he's playing to have fun, then why are his charges so less? Just because it's one rupee? We should not doubt Babu unnecessarily. Get it? No. I have a strong feeling that I have met Babu before. Yes, I have also seen Babu somewhere before. The king had also mentioned something similar about him. We may not be too late. Raju, Chutki and Jagu, you go to the palace and ask His Majesty where he had seen Babu before. Kalia, you come with me. Can you remember anything, Your Majesty? Mm, no. I don't recollect a thing. Your Majesty, meet Babu. I mean Natwarlal. <laughs> this Natwar guy has played a game on all of us. He trained Paro for this game and Paro, like a parrot, spoke everything that was taught. Having been a neighbor of Dholakpur for a long time now, he knew everything about us. And Babu told me that Batakpur is planning an attack on us. Going by his words, I was sending my army to attack them. Bhim has prevented me from making a big mistake. Soldiers, arrest this man and put him in jail. <laughs> 
Your Majesty, I shall go to Batakpur and clear this misunderstanding with the king. Go on, Bhim. Wait, stop! Come no further. I come here in peace. You're Bhim, right? Why are you talking about peace? Are you not aware that your army has planned an attack on our kingdom? There's been a huge misunderstanding. Please take me to your king. I beg you. Oh, I see. Soldiers, take him to meet our king and give him his chance to propose peace. He has trapped us all in his vicious game. That crook Babu made our king believe that you are planning an attack on us. And he narrated the same story to me. What a game plan! We are thankful to you and Tholakpur. If you hadn't approached us by now, we would have definitely attacked. You are very courageous to come up to an army waiting to attack you as an enemy. I, the king of Batakpur, bestow you with the title the Royal Jewel. Long live the Jewel! Oh my god, what's what's this? Huh? <laughs> It's good, Bhim, that you are here. I have seen the dragon with my own eyes. Forgive me, Your Majesty, but is Your Majesty absolutely sure that you have seen a dragon? Yes, this is very bad news. Very soon he will prey on the small animals. Huh? Dragons spit out fire when breathing. We are not capable of imprisoning or killing him. We should transcare him. Maybe then he'll run away. I agree, General. Bhim, you go along with the army and help them out. Of words. because she was scared princess 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 wake up now you're safe with us we can't wait here any longer raju the dragon will return at any time now i will take the princess outside and you you help the animals get out of here raju chutki and jaggu the three of you take the princess and the animals back I'll stay right here and stop the dragon from causing any more destruction. Okay. <gasps> Let me tire him. You people go back to Dholapur and wait for me. 